Good. That was just crazy. Let me eat. Let me drink some more of this feet. What is going on? It's your boy Angel Casanova, and you're back at a, at a back with another Uber vlog. No, this is not even Uber. This is a caviar vlog. I'm gonna try out caviar because this dude here, my brother Jay, he he decided, hey, you know, you could get paid more doing caviar. I was like, and that's right, caviar, which is the leading rideshare service in San Francisco. Uh, did I say rideshare? I meant delivery app. Caviar is sweeping the nation now, but it actually originated in San Francisco. Uh, Jermaine Ellis, if anyone knows about him, he's one of those uh, top YouTubers doing this stuff. It's now over on New York, and now it's starting to really, you know, get its name up there. But most people are usually familiar with Postmates, Uber Eats, DoorDash, Grub. Huh. Everybody's used to those three, the Uber Eats, the Postmates, DoorDash. But out here, caviar is kind of more foreign than anything. Like nobody really yeah. does the caviar here. I should have been one of them, know. but I don't know what happened. It's, it's, that's, uh, that's why today I'm going to start trying out the caviar courier app, the delivery app. I said, all right, I'm going to try caviar. Cool. If I make $600, I'm going to give you half. Uh, that's a lot of money. For, 300 for I'm not gonna lie. That's a huge target for you to be hit for trying to hit because you haven't even really done a full week yet I, I've done it with uber. Yeah with uber, but you got to think about caviar This is why I'm saying it caviar is a completely different system than postmates and uber eats It's not it's not all day postmates and uber eats is all day caviar is only specific times Oh, okay. Let's try to hit at least 400. Realistically, you're gonna get 350, 400. That's so realistic. If I hit $400, right? Because he's gonna videotape the whole thing, document it. And if I hit 400, we're gonna share that half half, right? If I make less than 350 or 300, he's gonna get 25%. And we're back at it again. So right now, I'm gonna I'm gonna start the the actual app. I don't know if you can see it, but um, it says offline here, so I'm just poop. Or, or I gotta slide it. I gotta slide it. Online. Searching orders now. Is is it is it like pull up that map? Yeah, I'm getting Oh, we're not even in the hot. We're like the outer ring of it. Oh, just fine. Oh, yeah, you're in a horrible position. You're supposed to be like under 14th Street. Ah. Not all the way up here in the 20s. That's true. So, yeah, you're supposed to keep driving down a little more. Just a little more. I bet. We'll see you when we're in. This is a first. $10. Mm -hmm. We'll be expecting your. Yo, oh, yeah, oh, oh, gotta hold it. I gotta hold it. I gotta hold it. I yeah, thought I accepted it. Um, order pickup, ready for pickup at. Oh, so it's already ready. That was a hella weird. I guess I got all four items. I almost pressed complete delivery. Mm. Um, I had to go through that service entrance side, yeah. which is legit just garbage area. I was gonna say you should tell the customer right now. Hey, I just left. I just left via Cartola with your your delivery. I'm I'm 20 minutes away. So this is Jay, this is my brother. You know, I've known him since he was born. Um, for like what? For 22 years, how old are you? For 23 years, about, it's, it's gonna come up to 23 years in, in October. Uh, we'll say 22 years. 22, I don't even know, bro. I've Cause been, we really met in 97. That's when we were formally introduced to you. You're right, you're right. True that. So, how, how has it been living with me or us living together? I mean, when I moved from my old place in 97 to the place that we are now, I mean, you know, I was just coming off of a rut. Really, I was coming off a rut and... And you were in a dark place for a while, huh? Right. Uh, you know, but, you know, you know. Uh, this is my first delivery of caviar, and we're gonna take it to, uh, it doesn't even say the customer's name here, but, uh, thank you. So I'm gonna make this delivery to this customer right now. Don't say anything about the GoPro. I'm gonna hide it. Delivery for... Thank you. It's dark. 
in here. Put the light here. I hope that didn't catch what flow I'm going to. Tornarelli, Boyo alla Griglia, and Nugio Arancini. I think I got it right. Hi, right, what's going on? Here you go, you enjoy that, okay? Thank you. Alright. I'm so bro, I'm gonna have almost a little mess my elevator. <laughs> I made 10 bucks and one cent. That was, it wasn't even three minutes. I got another one. Six dollars. Mediterranean grill. They're giving you until 7.05 to get that to the customer. Oh, they even give me an, this merchant frequently misses items. Please make sure you have all the items. You know what? Up here, buddy. They should have that for Uber because the McDonald's I always order from always misses items. Always. Just a tip. They're giving this dude a half an hour to get that across the street, basically. Oh, I think, uh, yeah, they're, they're doing some weird shit, but <laughs> it sent him to New Jersey by mistake. But we're gonna get this, you know, taken care of. I can't see the map right now. It's kind of bugging, but he doesn't have to go that far. So, um, that uh, order that we just picked up right now, this uh, caviar thing is not using its own map map so to speak, is using the Apple Maps, right? And whenever I click on the actual address that they provide to me on the uh, Courier app, the app itself, uh, the Apple's map is sending me to Jersey, right? So me and him, we just spent five minutes trying to figure out why it's sending us to Jersey. Then one location was sending, sending him to Brooklyn. And he's telling me that the location is under, it's like underground where like, like, I don't know if you have, if you have been to uh, 30 Rock. And when you go underground, there's mass shops and shit like that. So it's something like that. It's fucking weird. It's right here. And here it is right here. And it says Turnstile Underground Underground Market. But And there should be the Mediterranean Let's Grill. Go ahead and do thing and take that GoPro. We're going to switch over. Uh, guess I'll be right back. <laughs> be right back. Okay. Don't touch it. Oh, I thought it was like a subway thing. My bad. I can't seem to find the place. And I think this is where it ends because then there's the train station. Yeah, it's not here. I don't, I don't, I don't see it here. The Mediterranean, unless it's like around the corner. There's a corner. Uh, the turn. Oh, it's right here. There it is. Thank you so much, Paul. How are you too? So it took me a while. I went to the ass end. It's like if you went inside the train station and there was like mad like like you're in a food court mixed with a train station. So apparently we didn't have to go to Jersey or Brooklyn, but now that we have the food, they're giving him 15 minutes to do this. The second delivery. And so I mean he made it there about eight minutes early. I'll be right back. Alright. Okay. I'm gonna have to So what I'm gonna have to do. Oh this is where all the couriers meet. Because there's some turnstiles here. What's going on guys? Abraham? The Smith. I'm saying? The Smith. No, that's not me. <laughs> Smith? I think that's it? Yeah. That'll yeah. help a courier get his own order out because he was busy talking to another courier. Well, I guess my boy Abraham is all the way up in the, the high floors. There you go. Here you go, sir. Enjoy. All right. All right, finally, we got my guy. And uh, let's go on to this third delivery. This, uh, this was $6, right? So we should be like around 16, 17, around there. 671. So we gotta tally that up. Whatever it says on the screen, that's how much we got right now in total. We're only two deliveries in and we're up over six. And he has another delivery coming in. Another one, bro. <laughs> two deliveries in, he's up 16 bucks. He's got another one though. <laughs> 1060. Second Avenue Deli. I know where that's at. 
Yeah, some dude right next to me needs to get out of his parking. He fuck you up? No. Hi. Right. I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. Okay. So. I had a sign for the goddamn thing. You know that, right? I had a sign for this. Oh yeah. Yeah. I was thinking. I was gonna ask you. Um. I forgot that they make you sign. Yeah, for that. Second Avenue Deli makes you sign. Yeah. But like the first couple times I went to deliver, the nigga was an asshole to me. Mm. But I was like, all right, whatever. I might come back here. Doesn't matter what delivery company. Wait, Second Avenue Deli on first? Okay. Yep, I know, I know. They, they never really made any sense to me either. And then they do that pre-verification where like, you gotta sign Jeez. and do all this stuff. Right. And how can I trust you if your shop says Second Ave and you in first? Yeah, I mean, he, he got here about 12 minutes early. I don't know what's wrong with him, but he's just getting to these places pretty fast. Okay, I'll be back. Oh man, I love deliveries like that. When I, I don't have to go upstairs and a customer comes down and tells the uh, tells me or the delivery guy, hey, just leave it downstairs or I'll pick it down, pick it up downstairs. The best. Sounds like a cell phone right on if anything. It's like you're getting the delivery number four. $12. This is fourth pickup, uh, but my thing is, I'm thinking you're about to, uh, you're about to tap out. Yeah, because I, I haven't slept, I'm not gonna lie to you. I didn't sleep till like five or six, and I didn't even sleep properly, to be honest with you, because um, I had Juz, and Juz does not know how to sleep. He just sleeps like a starfish, so I just couldn't sleep. I think I ended up falling asleep at 7 a.m., 8 a.m., waking up at 10 with him just telling me that he wants milk, so. This is gonna be the fourth and last delivery. So they're giving him until uh, 8.15 here to deliver this last, uh, to get this last delivery done. He's uh, He's got 10 minutes and he is, I believe, a mile away or something like that. So, and also we're gonna, we're gonna tap out here. I thought we were gonna be able to do six, but four is gonna be the total for Monday. Um, we'll see it somewhere around on the screen. 38 bucks, Monday's total, four deliveries, 38 bucks. Last drop off. Kind of sad. Yeah. What's that stupid traffic, bro? Your call has been forwarded to a voice message system. Well, let me see. If he answers well, yeah. to Instagram, <laughs> 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 yeah, and then you're as you're the weeks, up. as the days go on, yeah. we'll get better. With this Bullshit. Time. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. I'm here at the place, but the revolving doors are locked, the side doors are locked. I'm trying to call the customer, but he's not answering. What's that stupid traffic, bro? one more time and I'll let you guys know what's up. It ain't answering and uh... Hello? Hello? Hi, this is Hi. your courier. I'm I'm downstairs. Uh, I'm downstairs with your order. Oh, I don't I don't see. You. And I'm gonna make my way halfway towards you, okay? Alright, see you. See you. <laughs> Should meet her here. Okay. Hi. Are you hi? Yes. <laughs> here you go. You enjoy that Thank all right? You. All right. Have a lovely evening. You too. Thank you. All right. Yo, she was about to give me a kiss. <laughs> I just dubbed that. I was like, <laughs> stiff arm. <laughs> All right. Um, I went there. Apparently, there's two entrances to this building, and this one is closed. The other side was open, and I called it like three times, and then we just met up around the corner. So today's total is forty dollars and twenty cents before tips. We're gonna go grab some grub, not from Hub, and it's gonna be seamless. So. I see what you did there. I'm over here at the Washington Heights spot. It's called, uh, it's called, um, Empanadas Monumental. Monumental. Yes, it's, uh, it's right there by the two train, I think. Damn, you're so bad with direction. I am. But yeah, they definitely serve the best 
the chosas and the best jaroas. He's gonna taste a lechosa for the first time. Oh, this is awful. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't even know. Maybe we got different, That's different bad. taste buds. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. That's good. It tastes like feet, right? <laughs> Guys, I'm gonna have to give that a seven. Oh, okay. That's pretty decent. Because it tastes like feet initially, and then it tastes like mad good. Yeah, exactly. When I first tried this, when I tasted it, I was like, oh, it tastes like feet. Mm, but it tastes it tastes good. It has this, like, this good aftertaste. Right. It tastes like ass. Tastes but like, if you eat ass, this is the thing for you. It tastes like feet and ass. I'm not sure about the ass part. That just sounds crazy. <laughs> And also, there's just a nugget in here. Yeah, that was supposed to be my nugget for the road. Well, there was three and three. I ate three, because how are you gonna buy six fresh nuggets and then just let them go cold? Yeah. What kind of a monster yeah. does that? If I were you, I'd take the